Okay, so I'm going to do a quicker tutorial than the thermal expansion. I'm going to stop that for a bit because I thought I want I thought I should make a easier to make quarry than the build craft quarry which takes 8 diamonds. This only takes 3 diamonds and it's very simple. What you need to do is make a mining turtle. Now to make a mining turtle, you need a turtle which needs a computer. To make a computer, you need <coughs> 7 stone, 1 glass pane, has to be a pane and a redstone. Now, I, actually, I decided to make this easier, by the way, to have it like this. To make a turtle, you put the computer in the middle with the chest, and you put iron surrounding that. Then you add a non-damaged pick just straight from the crafting bench with a turtle to make a mining turtle. Now, how to use this. Now, <clears throat> there are programs out online that actually allow you to <clears throat> make quarries with these, but I'm going to show you the easiest one that I have found. Now I'm going to go and do it here. And just, oh, here's random. Okay, so actually, this is, uh, okay. Um, hold on while I find a better location. Okay, so <clears throat> I believe you need an internet connection for this. By the way, I actually found one closer. I was going in the wrong direction. And... I also have everything that you need to make this completely automated. Although I don't have coal in my inventory, that's another story. So, first you place it down. Now, if you don't want to make this automated, oh, yeah, then you can just ignore this part and ooh, like, and just skip ahead to when I actually start using the mining turtle, but I want to make this automated so that you can see that you can actually automate this completely. So, I'm just going to put pipe here. Now you don't need a copper chest, but I or that's a gold chest. I thought okay, you don't need a gold chest, but I would recommend it because this will not won't won't as I've seen overflow. Although you might have to check it out, but that's at your discretion. Now, I also re would recommend something called a chunk and I, okay, maybe it's not called Chunk Loader. Okay, maybe they changed the mods. Um, hold on, uh, gold, actually no. Uh, I'm sorry about this, but I wanna see if they still have it and chant and then usage. Oh, I can't do that. Oh my God, that's annoying. Uh, where is enchantment tables? Here it is. Now, hopefully it's still in here. Yes, it is. It's called a chunk loader. How come it didn't come up? Maybe it's... Oh, I don't think it's on the... Uh, there we go. Chunk. Yeah, it's here. Okay. So, I would advise a chunk loader. Um, I will show you how to make that in just a second. But you would probably want that maxed out just so that it never despawns because if it despawns it will forget whatever program it has to make it you need gold one ender pearl and an enchantment table which needs four obsidian two diamonds and a book so it's actually technically if you add all this in takes three four five six seven diamonds because you want a diamond chest diamond transfer pipe which you get eight of them so it's fine now <laughs> if you don't put this in then you'll have to sit here and just sit here. So just a heads up. Now that's all I need, and I probably should have gone to creative and deleted this stuff. So I don't need any of this. Actually, I don't need that either. And now I need cobble, dirt. I need two cobble, two dirt. I don't need two, but oh well. Uh, and flint. Where's flint? Flint. Why am I talking? Why am I saying flint? Gravel. And optional dirt, but I don't. Doesn't really matter. So first, you want to put in the ye yellow, which is kind of like the escape. You can put anything here and delete them, but I'm just gonna leave it. Um, cobble, dirt, and gravel, and then coal. 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 Where is coal? And then you want coal to go to green which oh, I always right click which then will send it back to this chest now this chest and this chest are important so what you do is you go into the turtle here you place cobblestone you 
place dirt, and you place gravel in these three slots. You place coal here, and now this is optional, a chest. What this will do is it will loot the chest instead of destroying it. If you don't put this here, whatever chest loots there will never be picked up. Now, what you want to type in is paste bin get 3mke capital U Z B Y and then whatever name you want to give it. I call it Cory. Just it's easy. It's easy to type. All you can just call it here just for these purposes, I will call it Q. So then you press enter, it connects, and then it downloads as Q. Then you press whatever you named it. So Q. Never go over 20. This is how this is the diameter that this is the radius it, it goes in the square so it goes from here 20 blocks that way and 20 blocks that way from its current position if you go over 20 i find that it deloads and you just lose it so i'll just leave it at 20 and then as you can see in the upper right there is a, a bottom number of 65 or 64 or you can just check it with a three and you want the Y coordinate. Now, what this does is it tells it where bedrock is, so it'll dig down directly to bedrock. So it wants to go to, okay, that's saying 63, this is saying 64. I'd go with the Y. So 63, don't know why it's buggy. 63, and then you press enter, and then it will mine. It'll just automatically mine. And then what you do is you put coal in here for it to be automated, help us more. And then it'll always come up here, and take it. Now you want to power these. I forgot to do that. You can either do a lever or not. Uh, I always do that. Doesn't matter if you have a lever, lever or not. But then this will keep going, and it's completely automated. You once you have this, it's completely automated. You you never have to come back here, especially of this. And well, if you put a lot of coal in here, then it's definitely automated. But any fuel source will work. And what is he mining? Um, so yeah, this is my tutorial, and mm. I guess I'll should lapse to when this thing has actually mined some stuff, so that you can see. By the way, it goes right to diamond level, mm. so it automatically mines diamond first. See, it's going down it's in the cave. It's at 23 now. If we keep going and follow it, it'll go all the way down to either bedrock or close to it. And then I want to the bedrock, and then I think it's coming. Oh no! Then it goes up, and it doesn't mine all of this. It skips three, or I don't know what it's doing actually. I've never actually come down here, but it does skip three or two eventually. Like I forget exactly how it works, but it's doing its thing, and it is completely automated. I have tested this many times, so I will be back when it is done. I guess so. I'll be back. So as it's run out of inventory space, it's now coming back up, and we will see what it has found. Let's just wait. And wait. So what it'll do is it'll plunk it in the chest, as you can see, and then this RMA system will pull it out. And then it will grab whatever coal is in here, and then it'll go back down. Now it hasn't found coal, which kind of sucks. You might want to put a lot of coal in here, like four stacks-ish, maybe a little more, just so that it can find coal and get enough. So what this will do is it'll automatically just... Oh, I should actually... Before this gets too hectic... Where's the cacti? Here's some cacti. And then I'll do this. There we go. And so that will just destroy them. You don't have to put that. You can put love or something there. But it'll work. And then, yeah, that's a lot of cobble. But it'll put this, this, and this, and this in here. Because we set it to nothing. You can even put stuff that you'll know it will never find. Actually, even better. Another star. I just put these in my inventory randomly with a companion cube. So yeah, that's essentially this. Nothing will go back. Oh, here's I can prove this. It's coming. Now the only problem with this is that with these V's, if you ever played Thomcraft, 
it'll make flux which is bad and it, I don't know how bad it will make it but hopefully not too bad now you can actually make this automated by putting another diamond pipe here or here and making um, smelting and everything but I'm not gonna show that because this is the basics and you don't even need all this you can just empty out the chest manually but that might take a while so this has been Yoshi King 4 and I hope you enjoyed and I hope this helps and this is very much less expensive than a quarry which takes eight diamonds eight gold uh sick no a lot of iron and redstone and all this stuff this is a lot cheaper and i feel a lot more effective as you can see it's not been very long and it's already mined out this so it'll mine 20 that way 20 that way it always apparently goes right when you place it it goes front and right and then it does a square that way as you can see we placed it going facing this way and it'll go that way don't know why that's just how it's programmed <coughs> i have <coughs> been yoshi king 4 and i hope you have enjoyed and i hope it helped